now we need to count on in ones. So here we start with 95. That's 9 tens and 5 ones. Then we have 96, 97, 98, 99. And then if we add one more one, we have 100. That's because now that we've got 10 ones, we need to exchange those 10 ones for 110. But doing that gives us an extra 10. So we've got 10 tens all together, and we need to exchange those for 100. So now, if we keep on adding ones, we get 101, because we've got 100, 0 tens, and 1 1, then 102, 103, 104. Now, 634, so there's 600s, 3 tens, and 4 ones. We're counting in ones, so next we have 635, 636, 637, 638, 639, and if we add one more one, we get 640, because we can exchange our 10 ones for one more 10, meaning that we now have four tens and zero ones. Then 641, 642, 643. Now we start with 805, so that's eight hundreds and five ones. Next, 806, 807, 808, 809, 810, because we can exchange these 10 ones for 110. Then 811, 812, 813, 814. And now 296, so we have 200s, 9 tens, and 6 ones. Then 297, 298, 299. And if we add one more one, we get 300. That's because we've now got 10 ones. So we can exchange those ones for one extra 10, but doing that gives us 10 tens. So we need to exchange those 10 tens for an extra 100, meaning that we have three hundreds, no tens, and no ones. So if we continue counting in ones, we get 301, 302, 303, 304, 305. We can also show counting using place value counters. So first we started with 95, so that's 9 tens and 5 ones. Then we continued adding ones. So here we have 9 tens and 9 ones, so 99. But you can see if we have one more one, we get 100, because we can't have more than 9 in any place value. So we can't have 10 ones. We need to exchange those 10 ones for 110. But doing that gives us 10 tens. So we need to exchange those 10 tens for 100. Then we can continue counting in ones until we get to 104. Then we started with 634. So there's 600s, 3 tens, and 4 ones. We can keep on adding ones, but when we get 10 ones, we need to exchange those for 110, and then we can continue adding ones until we get to 643. So 600s, 4 tens, 3 ones. Then we started with 805. So 800s, no tens, and 5 ones. We can keep on adding ones, but when we get 10 ones, we need to exchange those for 110. And then we keep on adding ones until we end up with 814. So 800s, 110, and 4 ones. Now 296 means we have 200s, 9 tens, and 6 ones. We can keep on adding ones, so here we've got 299, but if we add just one more one, we get to 300. That's because we've now got 10 ones, 
So we need to exchange those 1s for 110, and doing that means that we have 10 tens. So we exchange those 10 tens for an extra 100, which means we have 300. Then we can keep on adding 1s until we get to 305.